The frontline treatment tends to be synovectomies, either through an arthroscopic surgery or an open approach. With localized PGCP, surgery may be curative if complete resection is achieved. However, uh, diffused patients and diffused PGCP is typically more difficult to treat, requiring multiple surgeries and with the recurrence rate being around 50% in the literature. So it's much harder to treat uh, the diffused type, while localized PGCP is mostly amenable to surgery, so the recurrence rate is quite low at 15%. And so due to this cycle patients go through of seeing their primary care provider, uh, rheumatologist, orthopedic surgeon, or sports medicine, it is often uh, not until patients become unresectable and or complications arise from surgery that that leads them to see an orthopedic oncologist and potentially a medical oncologist. And the advent of these targeted therapies, these small molecule compounds and biological therapies like pexidartinib that was approved in 2019 is changing the treatment paradigm that we're seeing. And so with the approval of a small molecule drug that targets CSF1, this has opened the door for other uh, trial compounds like DCC3014 as well as AMB. Uh, 05X that attempts to increase the selectivity of targeting the CSF1, but also creates a higher tolerability profile. So those are in trial as well.